My name is Sylvia Museya. I am Principal Secretary, State Department for Wildlife under the Ministry of Tourism and Heritage in Kenya. The opportunities for insurance schemes for the human rights are one. We have the opportunity for political goodwill where it has now become a matter of concern. And so the government of the day is prioritizing uh, compensation for victims as part of its uh, mandate towards making a people-centered government. We have an opportunity from the media. There's been uh, a long drought session in Kenya, and that drought session has made too many wildlife coming out of the protected spaces to in search of water, in search of uh, food, uh, during, and a lot of interactions with human beings on the side. And that has received massive uh, media coverage and so it only makes my case very easy to say and need of insurance. Number three, there is already some practices happening for insurance for livestock and insurance for crops within the Kenyan government. So it is, it, well, whereas it is a new product, uh, it is something that is being piloted in, in other non-mainstream insurance uh, spaces. So that becomes a conversation that we can continue to pick, pick up from uh, somewhere and we continue with it. Uh, and number four, we have the opportunity of a lot of partnership from especially non-state actors who are willing to help us develop the product and even grow it out. The challenges we are having, one is data. We have been paying compensation for human wildlife conflict in an haphazard manner. Sometimes there is a budgetary allocation for it, sometimes there is not. So you find we pay this financial year, we stay another two years, we do not pay, we pay another financial year. We do not know how many claims we have per, per year, we just know we have um, this amount of claims uh, cumulatively. So it becomes very difficult for us to quantify exactly how much we do we need in premiums per annum. Of course, number two, we have a, a challenge of um, fraud. There has been a bit of reporting uh, that uh, sometimes communities uh, in conjunction with the uh, Kenya Wildlife Service who manage it, might use manage the scheme, uh, would claim compensation for death outside the human wildlife uh, conflict uh, zone. So that if a person dies and you think you can be able to get a shilling or two from it, you can maneuver around mm -hmm. and make sure that they are paid. Of course, we'll have a big challenge of budgets. Uh, it is a new item. Uh, of course, we have a cash crash uh, all over the world. And uh, budgets are such that we are trying to try and um, minimalize and go to the basics of healthcare and education. And so, piloting or asking for all this amount of money for insurance is going to be a problem. Um, and then, implementation of insurance is a new product. Uh, we have a new, uh, everything is a new setup, so we it's just a new conversation, so implementation will have its own teething problems. The next step for the government is that we have secured some money for piloting the insurance scheme. This financial year that starts in July. Um, we are working with a number of insurance companies or consultants to develop a product. Part of them are here in this uh, conference. So, and of course, uh, the next step is that we will roll it out. We are rolling it out by July. We will look at how uh, it will look like, but on a pilot phase.